Stereoisomers are molecules that have the same atom-to-atom -atom connections, but those connections have different geometries. Consider a simple alkene such as butene, where the double bond is between carbons 2 and 3. As we have already discussed, double bonds do not rotate, so 2-butene can exist where the methyl groups are on the same side of the double bond, or on different sides of the double bond. If the substituents are on the same side, we say that it has cis stereochemistry. If the substituents are on opposite sides, it has trans stereochemistry. Cycloalkanes also exhibit this cis-trans stereochemistry because two substituents can either be on the same side of the ring or on opposite sides of the ring. The simplest way to illustrate this is to draw the ring in the plane of the paper and illustrate and illustrate the substituents as either dashes or wedges depending on if they're coming towards you or away from you. Cis-1,2-dimethyl cyclohexane then would look like this. because both methyl groups are on the same side of the ring. More accurate descriptions of the conformations of a cyclohexane are not as simple to interpret. As you can see in this three-dimensional model, these two green substituents are both on the same side of the ring. Notice that this green one is above the plane. This white, which is a hydrogen, is below the plane. And then this green is above the plane, and that white is below the plane. So the three-dimensional geometry is not as easy to interpret. One way to illustrate this is with a projection, where we're simply trying to project the shape of that cyclohexane ring. So if I bring my model back, notice that the carbon atoms are in sort of this, it looks like a chair, conformation and that's what we're illustrating here is the chair. So if we look at this we notice that this top example has a methyl group that's above the plane and a hydrogen that's below. If we look over here, the hydrogen is below, and the bromine is above. So this stereo isomer would be cis, because the methyl group and the bromine are both above the ring. This last example shows two methyl groups attached to the cyclohexane ring, where this methyl group is below the ring, and this methyl group is also below the ring. So this is also a cis stereoisomer.